let's have a look at the margin analysis. So for margin analysis, the first of all, the comprehensive dashboard where you can have the look of the, how much is the net margin? What is the margin per se? Corresponding growth degrowth at company level. The comparison of net margin versus intake margin, which are the division or the most contributing in net margin and the top side. And after that, the bifurcation at various different levels. What is the uh, month-wise uh, contribution considering the margin? And the size-wise trend for net margin, margin percent, the ranking considering the margin at site level or the product level also, the division level, what is the trend? And what is the net margin, margin percent? So overall view, of the margin dashboard and after that if you want to specifically identify where you are having loss so for that what is the uh, loss amount for current year previous year and the month wise trend for only loss from this loss dashboard you can clearly identify the loss means which month which site you are having loss so you can clearly identify the size which are making maximum of loss or the products which are causing loss. And after that, if you want to specifically identify the reason of the loss, so for that, you just first need to select the dimensions from the dimension level along with the type product level, I'm also selecting vendors. So here, this is the parameter based analysis and the parameter is, I want to identify those side products, vendors, where the margin percent is less than 10%. So for that, I can identify along with the sales and how much stock I'm having, is the MRP amount, promo amount given, or the staff discount amount, means the various parameters to track where the actual loss is happening. And the same way profit tracking details reports are also there and various other reports considering markdown, intake versus actual. These types of details reports are there for the overall margin-wise analysis. Mm -hmm.